All right, here we go. Let's go. So, about two minutes ago, I walked up to you and I was like, do you have five minutes? Yes. Because <laughs> I want to interview you about something. Okay. Um, is there, just by asking that question, just by walk, just by walking up, what's kind of going through your mind right now? Oh, uh, <laughs> what's I've in my mind now? Yes. Uh, I don't know what, how, um, why you asked me to do this interview. It's, it's yeah. fun. <laughs> yeah. But you said yes. Like, yes, that's awesome. Because I, I'm curious. <laughs> yeah, awesome. I want to know. That's awesome. <laughs> So this is gonna be about. Well, first off, what's your name? I didn't get your name. My name is Pauline. Paul. Pauline. Pauline. Yes. Okay. My name is Chase. Chase. Okay. Chase. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. <laughs> so I wanted to ask you for an interview because I help people who s stutter. Do you know what a stutter is? No. A stutter is like what I just did right there. So it's. Stutter. It's when your speech yes. gets kind of blocked, and it, it might sound like s -s 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 stutter. Okay. Or it might sound like stutter, or it might sound like my name's Ch -ch 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 Chase. Okay. Okay. Do you understand? I think so. I'm not sure. I think so. Okay. <laughs> have you ever met anyone with a stutter? Yes, I have a friend who who speak like that. Really? Yes. A friend. Yes. Wow. And is it a good friend? No, I I know him. It's not my super friends, but I know him. Okay. And like, what is your what is your perception of that? Like, what what do you feel if I were to come up to you, like I just did right there, and if I were to be like, hi, do 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 yeah. do you have fun? five minutes yes but um i have a friend who speak like that so i can understand so for me it's normal i will listen to you as i listen someone who don't uh, speak like that it's not a problem but i i can understand that it's difficult for this person to speak mm. so I, I can't um lose about that or don't speak to them i just I just listen to yeah. them like a normal person who speak normal. Like a normal conversation. Yes. Nice. Uh, where are you from, by the way? From France. From France. Yes. I could have guessed that. <laughs> um, so, like, do you feel like if you didn't have that friend and you didn't know what that was, like, how would you feel any different about that or I don't know maybe because he he explained to me um, his feeling about that so now I, I understand but if I haven't this friend I don't know maybe I, I could be more more I don't know more distance yeah maybe maybe i don't know no 100 percent. that makes sense because if you don't know what is happening and you've never seen it before yes. then if someone like if someone were to walk up to me right now and would would talk like hey man how's it going <laughs> i would just yes. feel like i don't know what's yes, happening yes, right now yes. but like if that was the first time i've ever seen that then i'd be like okay there might be something a bit off but um do you feel like once you un once you were to understand what's going on if they were to tell you hey just so you know um that's a s stutter would it kind of lower your guard then what sorry if if like the if i were to walk up to you and and you've never had an experience with a friend yes yes and you didn't know what it was and i said do 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 you have five minutes and then right after that i were to tell you it's a stutter would you be like oh it makes sense now or would you still have that wall up oh i think even if i haven't my friends uh, i if you come to speak to me 
uh, even we see um, start, start, uh, <laughs> start, uh, um, I, I can speak with you maybe I, I could be more distant but if you continue to speak I will speak with you and I can come and speak and yes yeah. yes that's awesome so what do you feel like based off the little bit you know about a stutter right now what would you recommend to someone who, because the biggest, the biggest fear, and the, one of the biggest fears of people who stutter is to go and approach someone because in their head, it's like, yes. they, they won't know what's happening. They're gonna judge me and they're gonna think I'm a weirdo. Um, what, what would you do in the shoes of someone who stutters, who wants to say hi to someone, but is scared to? I think that um, they have to, um, don't care about people who judge because I think that people who judge are not very interesting interesting very and if um, if they go to speak with um, people maybe sometimes people could be distant but they, they have, don't care about that because there are lots of people who will speak with them and People will under. I think people will understand. They have to try. Yeah. They have to try and try and try again. Yes. And maybe, maybe it. Will, if they try, after the, their problem will be less important because if they, if they speak a lot, maybe it will. Their conversation will be better after. No. Yeah. I think that 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 is so true. <laughs> that is so smart too. It's like, like you said at the beginning, the people who judge are the people who are like they're they're the ones that are hurt inside. Yes. And it's like, why would you even want to like waste your energy? You waste your energy with them. Like, if you go up and you see that they judge you, you're like okay, it was nice to meet you. Yes. There, there's there's no harm in that. And then like you said just now. Um, go like when you actually meet someone or when you actually face that fear and you do it over and over again it becomes so much easier because you see that you didn't die yes and yes. you you see that um, the the outcome is just dependent upon if this person is in the right spot in their lives or not yeah yeah that's awesome what do you do for work or are you are you in school right now Yes, I'm in school uh, in France. I'm studying uh, engineering. Engineering? Yes. Nice. Yes. Well, what are you trying to do with that? I, I don't know. I study um, general engineering. There, I, I'm, there is no specialization right now for okay. my studies. But I, I think I will do some management after because I like manage a team. I don't know. I have time to to think about that. I think. Oh, one hundred, one hundred percent. I'm guessing you're like twenty three. Twenty three. Twenty three. Twenty. Twenty. Yes. Oh, nice. So are you out here by yourself at twenty years old? Uh, sorry. I said, are you out here all solo by yourself at twenty twenty years old? I'm solo. For are you in Colombia? Ah, uh, Colombia. Uh, no, I'm. I travel with a friends uh, because uh, with our school we have to do we have to be abroad three months. You have to. Yes, that's I have pretty nice. To, yes, I have to work abroad, so uh, I'm here for months and off with my friends, um, and we work here. You uh, work here. Yes. Here. Oh really? <laughs> yes, and after we go to Nicaragua to work in an hostel, too. That's awesome. Yes. Holy shit. Cool. Well, um, I may have forgotten your name. <laughs> what was your name? Pauline. Pauline. What was my name? <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> okay, good. <laughs> I don't feel bad. I don't feel bad anymore. Well, Pauline, my name is Chase. Chase. It was very nice to meet you. <laughs> nice to meet and you. And thank you for that interview. I've been thank you. holding this so awkwardly the whole time. <laughs> but um, yeah, guys, your stutter is only as bad as you make it. And Pauline is awesome. And 
have a great day. <laughs> See ya. That was awesome. You killed it. <laughs>